becoming visible. We've done it, we've done it! I'm Peter Brady. For some time, I've been working on the problem of invisibility. that feeling today. All feeling okay? No nerves at all? All calm? But first of all, we have to meet the next contestant. Thank you. Let's get on with the next one. <laughs> what B was a racket? A... Yes, bombing an acts of terror. Well done. That's a good start. <laughs> I didn't know, in fact, I've only found out since last we met, that you both play musical instruments. I and my predecessors, both Democrats and Republicans. What about loudmouth at the end there? I've been in public life for more than a quarter of a century. So almost no time at all. You must take it up again. But that would be a cowardly thing to do. Do you want me to start asking you questions, or would you rather we got on with the next game? Nobody has anything to gain by delay. Hey, Benton's mm -hmm. killing me. Here's another. What you was an American president called Grant? Uh, yes. The... Uh, uh, late. What were you going to say? Uh, the... You may be just too young to remember, and it's sad, but there it is. Here's another, which you'll know, all of you. <laughs> what F is a cheat? Free enterprise. Good interruption, wrong answer. What F is a cheat? Yes. The frozen Iranian asset. Yes, good one. There we are. Well, one game all, and we're into another decider. And uh, battling away here, are very evenly pitched, aren't you? I think you're terribly brave. I have seen four wars in my lifetime. I don't ever want to see another generation of young Americans bleed their lives into sandy jungles in the battlefields of Asia or the muddy Pacific or muddy rice paddies of Congress. I don't ever want to see another rice beachhead in Asia or the muddy bloody blood of fields of rice jungles of Europe. Anyway, let's get on with the job in hand, shall we? We have other things to talk about, but not just yet. It's the deciding game. Now, one all, and it means that whoever does this goes in for the gold run. Here we go. What are is a usually rambling performance. Yes. A president in the Oval Office. Yes, right. <laughs> yes. Good one. What C is a monster with a lion's head, a goat's body, and a dragon's tail? <laughs> dear, dear. Congress. What? A Congress. <sighs> Crisis. Have another go. Campaign. No. Communist parties. No. Here we go with this one. What M is where Humphrey Bogart ran Rick's Cafe in the film Casablanca? Managua. No. Honduras. No. Costa Rica. No. El Salvador. No. Guatemala. No. Here's another, which you'll know. <laughs> what N is what you are off if you are balmy or potty? Yes. With regard to uh, the... With regard to the... the uh... No, it's not quite right. It doesn't work in with the sentence, actually. Nut is the answer. You're off your nut. Okay, fine. The moment in your career when everything changes direction. That tragedy is over. Old Testament tit for tat. Inside Washington politics. Part of a tree you hold out for peace. 
It isn't nutmeg. Well, the big question now is, is he going to be our chickpea expert or is he going to get down there on the hotspot? Right, now it's your chance. Will you accept our invitation? Take the hotspot. Thank you and God bless you all. Answer.